What's up everybody, welcome back. I'm Abe and this is Eve Online and just on a lark because I got not bored, but I was doing these cash flow for Capsuleers missions and my uh, my little tutorial told me to check out the agency and so I did and and well there's a resource war right nearby, so I figured I would go and check that out and I don't know if you feel compelled to change things up, you might also grab onto something that you see here. Um, there's faction warfare nearby, there's uh, pirate strongholds, which it sounds like requires a fleet because they're challenging, but I don't know, I'm in my venture. Um, looks like the next mission would have given me a combat ship, but let's see, I'm just going to go and try this resource war. Now the first time I tried these, I went in, I had drones, and I set the drones on the uh, the enemy pirates that were there. Um, that turned out to be a bad idea, and I got myself either blown up or very close to blown up, and I managed to just escape with the, uh, well I guess by the skin of my teeth, but I don't really understand what that phrase means, so I'm just going to let it go there. but. Yeah, so I have no combat capability in this ship right now. I have no drones. Um, too young. Uh, all I have are these miners. I couldn't even fit the uh, the mining upgrade laser. And I'm trying to be judicious with how I allocate my skill points, so I'm not going to train into that because this person's not going to be a miner. But here we are doing mining, so whatever. Um, let's see. Let's warp to it and see. We've got garistas. And if we look over here, Garistas do Kinetic and Thermal. I don't know why I'm looking at this, because I can't change my resistances at all, but they take Kinetic. And again, I'm not going to be doing any damage, so... For what that's worth. Uh, mine 10,000 units of Polycrase and deposit it in the hauler. Um, okay, well, let's see if this gets me killed. At which point you can then decide that this is not something that you want to do with your free time because it's too dangerous and whatever. So, alright, so there are the enemy ships and I'm told that if I leave them alone, or I believe anyway, that if I leave them alone, they will leave me alone, which seems strange, but Let's see here. Can we add that to? Incoming yeah. All right. There we go. Allied hauler under attack. Yeah. So the hauler is under attack, and it looks like we've got somebody in the state military stockpile. Up. Oh, they're attacking me. Maybe. Maybe this frigate will defend me. They've got me targeted. Oh, look at that. run our shield booster which runs pretty quickly and let's see we'll keep our cargo open well I already have it open so look at our our, our ore hold yeah we need to protect ourselves here so this isn't going as badly as I thought it might but it's not going great. I haven't been blown up yet, so that's good. The asteroid is depleted. Oh, okay, that asteroid's depleted. And okay, so they want ten thousand units, not cubic meters, but ten thousand units of this ore. So. Yeah. Okay. I am getting lit up. Yep, that's bad. These these uh these frigates they're all targeting me. And that's probably not good. So I'm halfway through my armor. Let's go approach the orca. The asteroid is depleted. 
Okay. The asteroid is depleted. We may need to just warp out and come back. Oh, well, one of those got destroyed, so that's good. So we'll open up the Orca. We'll drop 25% capacity. 3,000. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, 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 we need to. Maybe if I orbit the Orca, it'll keep me out of trouble. Sure doesn't feel like it though. I turned that off just so that I could have the capacitor for shields, but it got me webbed. Yeah, the Garistas are not liking me for this. But... I think this may be doable. I may have to like warp out to repair myself, but we'll just uh, see how this goes. At the moment, I don't have anything else draining my capacitor, but that's a pretty weak web if it's if I'm still able to go 237. So it seems like these these uh, asteroids are pretty small as far as the quantity that they contain. I've got another 1,900. Reinforcements. Calling for reinforcements. Yeah, we need reinforcements. Um, yeah, if it weren't for this shield booster, I would be in big trouble. But you definitely do need to jump from one asteroid to the other because they don't have a whole lot of capacity within them. Maybe two cycles each? The asteroid is depleted. Yeah. So it would be nice if there was somebody here killing the pirates, but when I tried to kill them and I had drones out, it was uh I mean they're all aggroed on me now except for one of them. There's four ooh. Two. Okay, so yeah, once I had drones out and I was showing myself to be a threat, they came after me pretty quickly and they uh oh well, well, we got to protect ourselves. We uh we also like I was they they took a lot to kill. So it was both very dangerous and I was completely ineffective, which is a bad combination. Caller 50% capacity. So we need to get a few more. Oop, there we go. What's the range on these things? Isn't it like 10k? Yep, it is 10k. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. So we're going to need to get away from the Orca here. And... Nope. Okay. Alright. Hope our capacitor holds up and hope we have enough support in the way of Yeah, in the way of these NPC ships. And I hope my little shield booster. You know, if I was able to if I outfitted this ship for defenses against kinetic, I might be much more effective and not have quite so many problems. Just target a couple more of these. But it's nice that they have uh, friendly ships on the field to help you out. And we can get rid of that, which is blocking things, and we'll put that over there. Yeah, so now it's just the two ships, and that seems manageable. And we've got a couple more nearby. Yep, we got 3,000. So we need basically five, uh, 4,900. Uh, if we look in local, yeah, it doesn't tell us anything. Looks like there's a chat channel specific to the... Oh, more pirates. All right, well, that's troubling. It 
sucks when you get out of range and yeah, end up losing cycle time on whatever you were mining on because these things take so damn long to to cycle. The asteroid is depleted. The asteroid is depleted. Okay, 3,500. Oh yeah, and the hauler's got to survive. So, personally, I feel like it's better if they attack the hauler than me, but that makes me, I guess, a little selfish. But I think this is... Yeah, I think that's the one that I'm in right now. And I hope that it will raise my Kaldari State Faction. Oop, oh, oop. Oh. Yep, let's use this opportunity to get some capacitor back. Now we're 15 kilometers away from the Orca, so once we get... Yeah, we're, we're almost there. At 5,000. I mean, really, we just need 48.57. But we can heal ourselves up. Yep, that's all we need. The asteroid is depleted. Here we come. Now, I don't know that I'm going to get much out of this. We'll see. I've got another two and a half minutes left on the site, so if that had taken me much longer... Those are the bounty prizes from the first... Okay, there's four enemies. Um, Yeah, from that first mission that I had done. Yep, let's take... Our ore hold and drop it in there. Yep. Hold Boom. Haul it or warping Mining to safety. Successful. I suspect that we need to do that now, too. Okay, we got stockpile. Uh, cash flow for capsulators, right? Let's read the. Let's set our destination there. Oh, 150,000 isk. That's not bad. We didn't get any grand bonuses, but we did get uh, standings gain. And we got loyalty points with the state military stockpile. I don't know if that's worth anything, but... But it was an interesting diversion. So that's that, and uh, we'll just keep pushing, and I'll get the, the Merlin from the next... Uh, the next cash flow mission, and we will just keep pushing towards finishing those and level one missions, which we can hopefully pretty quickly move right into level two. So stay tuned. Um, if you like what I'm doing, catch me on, uh, you can find me and support me over on Twitch. I'm at Vincis over there, and I am where you found me on YouTube at Vincis Gaming. So thanks for watching, and I will catch you in the next video.